Brian from WorkshopAddict.com and if you're in the market for a new DeWalt radio and you're having trouble deciding between the new DeWalt T-Stack Connect and the older DeWalt Tough System radio, I'm going to walk you through this and make your decision pretty easy because there is a big split as to how you would use these two radios in my humble opinion and I'm going to walk through it quick. First, sound. And I think this is where these two radios move apart pretty quickly. Both sound awesome. Don't let anybody tell you that they don't. They both have a single subwoofer in the bottom with another uh, bass amplifier next to it. They both sound great. If you listen to music at half volume, you'll barely notice the difference between the two. But if you're using these systems at full volume all the time, constantly, like in a shop setting and you want the radio loud, there's only one radio to choose here, and that's gonna be the tough system. There's some distortion that you get and you don't get quite the same volume from the T-Stack Connect. So if that's the type of listening of radio that you do, boom, here's your decision, pretty easy. Both of these will charge batteries, both of these will Bluetooth connect, but the big difference between the two is how the batteries sit inside, what can sit inside the compartments and how they open. First, the T-Stack Connect is obviously newer. So this unit here is going to hold the plug or adapter for the wall. As long as you're not putting a phone in here, it will easily sit in there. And this unit will also accept a flex volt battery. Now, this whole radio is, I think, IP54 rated, so it can get out in water. Uh, it can be in there, and it closes up nicely. I like that. There's a seal around everything. Pretty much the same thing can happen over here on the Tough system, except it won't accept a flex volt battery. It will accept the 20 volt batteries only. Opening the top where you would put your phone or try to hold the charger is a lot more difficult. Sometimes you got to open one side than the other. So if you're into storing items and storing your phone inside these, the T-Stack is where you want to go. Ease of use, there is a huge split here if you listen to an FM radio. Getting FM to work on the T-Stack or moving between channels is so much easier. Uh, mostly because you have an app that you can download. Now, if you listen to the radio, you're going to be disappointed in both of the radio receptions of these units. They, neither one has great uh, radio reception. So here I have a channel that you can get normally on most radios. One of the favorite ones I listen to, and it doesn't come in on either radio inside here. But picking your channels out and going through is much easier, even without the app, on the T-Stack. Now, if you need an app to run this or want an app to run this, which you don't need an app for either phone, the T-Stack is the only one with an app. That app allows you to turn this radio on and off and adjust the volume, which is nice if you're a little more remote from it. But at the same point, it doesn't allow you to put Pandora through it. It allows you to access some of the media on your phone and FM stations, and that's it. So for me, I don't use the app. Nice to have, nice to see. Uh, doesn't really work that great for me because I can do everything I want to just by Bluetooth connecting. So if you're a techie guy, the T-Stack is going to be more of where it's gonna be because you get a nice color screen, you have some uh, touch screen additions and just a little bit easier to move around. It does look a little bit better. Basically when it comes down to it, if you really want sound and you don't care about much other than sound and loud quality sound, it's at the Tough System. If you want something that you can throw in your office, something you can go camping with, something that you're not gonna be having a great large amount of sound constantly and just blaring, I think the T-Stack is probably the better choice. It's a little bit smaller. Uh, it has, they both have rubber all the way around them, but the rubber corners here, on the T-Stack are a little bit thicker. It stands up a little bit better when you're storing it. It generally has better storage on the inside. They have the same amount of speakers uh, on top. They all have two in the front, two in the back, but you can see that the Tough system has much larger mid-range and tweeters than the T-Stack. I guess also the other thing that would differentiate it if you're looking between the two, if you already have a Tough system rack and you want a radio, there's no choice. You're going to get the Tough system one. If you have the T-Stack stuff, you're going with the T-Stack. But in, if you have that stuff, you're probably not watching this video trying to decide between which two to go with. 
Here it is. Pretty simple, both great radios. I don't mean to knock either one. I just think there's a clear divide that if you're in a shop setting and you wanna really listen to some loud music and you can see here, I listen to some heavier metal, I guess, Five Finger Death Punch, Godsmack, things like that. There's a clear difference to me in the drums, in the highs, in the clarity that comes through the tough system. And the T-Stack unit, when I get probably to three quarters of volume, I start to hear distortion and I can hear that distortion a long ways away. And that bugs me, I want clear, I want crisp, I wanna hear all the drums, I wanna hear everything and enjoy it rather than have a little bit of distortion. But when I'm at home, when I'm camping or when I'm in a different area where I don't need the sound, I prefer the T-Stack because of the way the touch screen works, because I can use the app to turn it on and off if I wanted to and just because of the general newness of the radio and the ability to use the larger battery. Good luck with your purchase, guys. I know both these radios have been on sale this holiday season, and I hope this helps you out. Again, give us a like on the bottom of this video and subscribe to this channel. We have a lot of cool things coming out and a lot of holiday specials we'll go over. Thanks for your time. Have a great day.